Hey guys, welcome back to my channel. Today's video is going to be a Dollar Tree haul and I just wanted to come on here. I know I'm horrible at this and I'm horrible at bringing you guys videos, but I am here with a Valentine's Day uh, decor or Valentine's Day Dollar Tree haul for you guys. So I've been going like here and there because as you guys know that Dollar Tree doesn't put out everything at once and I've also picked up stuff from Target, Hobby Lobby, Dollar General and I think that's it. But I wanted to share some of the items that I picked up especially from Dollar Tree because they have some good items this season and if you're trying to do maybe like a, a gift basket or um, something small for like your children or your sisters or anybody um, you have to pick up some of the items now uh, if you wait until February they're gonna be gone I guarantee it like they go by so fast especially since the whole thing going on right now I mean all the decor usually flies off the like shelves so I just recommend you guys if you guys see them pick them up because you won't see them again. Um, so I'm going to just get started. Um, just want to say Happy New Year to you guys. And thank you guys for uh, being here with me. And continuing to be with me. Because you know I'm kind of. I'm not consistent with my YouTube channel. But um, I just you know been taking time for myself and my daughter. And she's doing the whole virtual learning. So you know. It's just, you know, there isn't anything exciting going on, so that's why I haven't really been posting, but we're going to get started because then I can talk too much. So I'm going to get started with um, some of the items, no particular order, it's just, you know, I'm going to share. Uh, I do have some containers that I picked up from Dollar Tree. I picked up this one. This one just has like the little love uh, wording all over in uh, the baby pink and I really like these containers because you can like add all kinds of little stuff even the little shred and then just add like candy or just you know stuff that your kids might like or whoever you're gifting this to um, put a I don't know a ribbon or something on it and it, it would be a cute gift I got some ribbon from the Valentine section and also the regular section. I don't want to say that these are all of them. There might be more, but these are the ones that I picked up. And I like to use these in different, you know, craft projects. Um, so I have, I think I picked this one up last year. This one was out last year. And then this one is a pretty, uh, like, buffalo check, but it does have, like, the gold rim around it. Let me just get up close so you guys can see. Um, this one says XOXO, but in the hearts. And then this one is pink, red, and white. So, and then in the regular section, I picked up this one, which is, like, a kind of, I wouldn't say baby pink. It's more like a hot pink but I think it's cute and you can also use this for Easter if um, you're planning to do Easter you can definitely use those for Easter I did pick up this little basket these come in a two pack he at the register was trying to like uh, ring it up for two items so just be careful when you are at Dollar Tree that they're ringing this item up for one item and not two but they do come in a two pack but this is just a little glittery um, basket i actually bought this because we gave my niece like a little gift basket but it came with two then another thing that i picked up at dollar tree which i think is super cute um they have these in different colors but these are the little jewelry boxes but this one is like now super baby pink color and then um does have like the gold rim they also have this in white which i gifted to my sister and then they have it in a teal and purple i believe um so these are really cute they're also really cute to gift you can also put these on your nightstand and put like your rings your earrings i always have studs so i always take them off and you know put them on my nightstand so these are like cute or you know for your kids little jewelry honestly whatever you want it for um 
I picked up some activities for like my daughter to do or I can craft with her just because she does get bored um and it's like you know they don't have enough to do but <laughs> they uh, she gets bored super fast so I picked up this one this one is the gnome one I think I'm gonna keep this one for myself it does come with like some gnomes uh, it says color your own decor I'm just gonna open it it comes with like crayons or not crayons markers but I don't think I'm gonna use those I'll just use something else so this is the one I really liked I could probably use like paint markers on these and then this one says I love you and it's so cute and these are the markers um, then I got these this one is for my niece and then uh, my daughter so it's a unicorn the the little unicorn is like has glitter on it it does come with the paint but you know that these ones are the little paintbrushes they suck so I would suggest using different and sometimes the paint does too so if you already have like acrylic paint use that instead of these ones but I mean for them to paint these are good then I picked up a couple hearts which these are craft ones but I just dropped one so hold on I picked up these craft hearts and I think I so I picked up this one. They have this one and it has twine on it. You could change out the twine for like ribbon that I just hauled. Um, so I picked up this one and then I picked up this one. I think I want to sand this a little bit down. I don't like how it has all these rough parts. But I saw a video. I'm not sure who did it. They did these as coasters and they put the back like the little felt and they use these as coasters so that would be a cute idea um but I just went ahead and picked this up I like this and I think I want to stain this but I don't know some other craft items that I picked up from Dollar Tree that are Valentine's Day are these DIY rock painting kits for you know honestly you don't have to use them for kids but I picked these up because uh, we, I normally decorate my dad's grave for um, all the holidays so I thought this would be a good idea for like the kids to decorate or me and my daughter to decorate and we could take these and just put them on my dad's you know grave and I thought they would be cute they're these rock um, like I said rock painting kits and they come with the paint already so this one says be mine this one it just has like um flowers let me see the glare is really bad and then i think there is a total of four this one has like roses and then this one says you rock i don't know if you can see that but this one says you rock on it and I just want to have these and put them like on his grave and stuff so I thought that would be a cute idea I also bought outdoor paint so I bought pink and um, red outdoor outdoor paint this is multi-surface this is the folk art one from Walmart I think they cost like a dollar thirty I want to say a dollar thirty seven and this is for uh, indoor and outdoor and it's dishwasher safe so I just picked up two of these from Walmart so we could use on the rock so they if, in case it rains then um, the paint will not mess up or anything like that so I just went ahead and got those two as well as just a regular pink one this is the apple barrel uh, cameo pink and it's a super like baby pink it's really pretty so I already started using it as you can see but I did pick these up from Walmart these are 50 cents at Walmart the other ones are $1.37 but I think it's because they're outdoor paints and you know they last longer then I picked up these heart containers uh, I thought these would be cute and I saw that they have tags in here I want to open these but it's going to make a lot of noise so I'm just going to try real quick to open these so they're little hearts like this and then they have little tags inside that are hearts and say happy valentine's day so it does come with a string as well 
so if you wanted to use them for like little crafts they also have that little hole right there if you can see i thought i could put some kind of candy in here and put them in a little basket for my daughter I did pick up one sign only from dollar tree this one is the one i like the best i actually haven't seen the gnome ones i've been looking for those because i think those ones are really cute but i haven't found them and it's okay if i don't but i found this one and it's this part is not glitter it's kind of like a foil like a i don't know iridescent foil i don't know it's really pretty it doesn't come off the heart is the heart they have glitter but i mean it's not a big deal and you can definitely change out the string if you don't want it but i think this one is really pretty and to me this is like a must pick up and i think i'm gonna just put it in the middle of a wreath that i have like a normal wreath and i think that's what i'm gonna do with that okay more dollar tree stuff that i have right here I did pick up some candies. Um, I wanted to pick these up now because I know by the time that I want to get them, they're going to be all picked over. It happened during Christmas and I just, I'd rather pick them up now. So I picked up these uh, Tootsie Roll and they say Love Bug on there. And then I picked up the Double Crisp Hearts. And these are good. I actually bought two bags of these, but I might have ate one bag already because they're so good. Um, Dollar Tree also sells these um, Hershey Kisses in the little red bags. I picked up two of these. Uh, these are really cute, like if you're going for a theme because they also have like a pink. Uh, what else? I like buying these for like teacher gifts, like when if I was to put like some in here. I would buy the red ones obviously for teachers and I think these are really cute. I don't know if they have other colors. I know for sure that they have the the pink, the red, and blue I want to say. But I'm not too sure. But I also bought this. It's a craft bottle and it. I want to say, I don't know if this is Easter or it's Valentine's Day. Actually, you know, what am I talking about? It has hearts all over it. So it is Valentine's Day, but uh, this craft bottle is cute. I'm going to open it. These papers get on my nerves. Okay, so it, it's a little craft bottle. You can use these for DIYs, but the, the lid is like a... I don't know what kind of pink it is, but you could put candies in here. You could put a gift card in here. Uh, tissue paper with a gift card. Really anything. But I thought that would be cute. I bought these. These are the mini bars. They come 12 in here. And these are... I don't know. I guess for Valentine's Day. But I bought these. I bought the Nerds. These come... Let's see... I don't nine I think nine little containers in here and then the now and laters these come 40 count so these you can even fill the little bottle and fill them up with the candy or whatever you want to do so I got those and then I did pick up one card and it is this one this one is a Hallmark one, but I think it's really cute. It says a Valentine's for you and you open up the little hands. But I picked this up for uh, my daughter. And then I picked up this basket. These are new to Dollar Tree. The size is new as well. They have different colors. I saw this like fuchsia pink because that's the color it is but i also saw gray um but these are nice uh containers for like different stuff because they are on the bigger side i don't know exactly what the measurement is on this but it's a pretty good size i just think you know you could give a gift in here you can fill it up with all kinds of nice little goodies for your kids or even you know if it's not for them for other people okay, so this might be a long Dollar Tree haul because it's already 15 minutes long but I did want to share some of the items that I got so um, I picked up this little mug and this one is not little actually what am I talking about it's actually pretty big for a mug um, I love this one 
I should have got a couple more just because if you want to give Valentine's Day gifts, you can actually add some stuff in here. You can add a Starbucks gift card. I just love how big it is and it separates from all the Ray Dunn that I have. And I have so much Ray Dunn that sometimes it could just get like too much and you want something different. So I did pick up this mug from Dollar Tree and I definitely recommend this. Um, I've been using it for the last couple days and I really like them. I want to get at least a set of four in those and then from I'm, I'm gonna share some of the other items that are Valentine's Day in this video but I picked up this hearth and hand mug as well like I said too much right done kind of just you know it's overwhelming and I picked up this one it's a hearth and hand one this was $4.99 and it does have the little XOXO on the little side I just I like how pretty it is but yeah definitely not Ray Dunn and I can appreciate something other than Ray Dunn so I did go ahead and pick this one up for myself from Target another thing I picked up from the Target dollar spot and it's the only thing that I picked up was this X XO um what are they calling it wreath uh I don't know how it would be I don't know it's a little wreath I guess and it does come with a hanger this was three dollars five dollars I'm sorry this was five dollars yeah um so yeah Target has been you know raising up their prices but I thought this was cute and I went ahead and got that from Walmart I picked these up these Walmart never has the prices on the stuff but I picked up these towels and they're with all the Valentine's Day stuff, and I want to say these were like $3.97, but they're these baby pink towels. It does come with a set of two. My Valentine's Day uh, theme, or not theme, but the colors I normally do are pink and red and white. Um, usually those are the colors that I normally go for. So I thought this would be cute for the kitchen and... I don't know if they're, yeah, they're kitchen towels. Uh, sometimes they say they're bathroom towels. Sometimes they say they're, um, you know, kitchen towels. So I went ahead and grabbed these because, you know, I just love how these hearts are kind of like, I don't know, they're, if you can see, they're not, they're in the towel, kind of textured. So I thought these would be pretty. And let's see, from Hobby Lobby, I got one thing as well. And with Hobby Lobby, I got this one the valentine's day stuff was coming out so not everything was out and i picked it up 40 percent off with the coupon and it's the little gnome and he has a little kiss on his little nose and i'm a big fan of gnomes like like for every holiday it doesn't matter but i love the little gnomes and i wanted to go pick up the other one because there's another one but he when I went the last time he was already gone so with this type of stuff especially the gnomes they seem to go by really fast if you see it pick it up use the 40% off coupon because I believe they're still not on sale so um yeah I only got him if I want to go back and see if I can get the other one still just go to a different one but these are super cute for tier trays okay so it's definitely gonna be a long video uh, I'm gonna share the Dollar General stuff. Um, actually, let me just share the other Dollar Tree items. So these are not Valentine's Day stuff, but, uh, I just wanted to share because, you know, you can use them for Valentine's Day. So I picked up these. These are these Beauty 360. So if you've ever shopped at CVS beauty 360 is a cvs brand it even has it on here that it's uh by cvs um so it's distributed by cvs so these were at dollar tree though these are little nail polish containers and you can it has little four compartments and it's a little cute cosmetic bag and I thought this would be cute either for easter or for valentine's day you can put some like nail polishes in here even if they're dollar tree ones you can use like um dollar tree nail polishes 
or SE nail polishes or OPI, whatever nail polishes you want to put in there. But this was at Dollar Tree. Went ahead and picked up two of these because I think I'm going to save these for Easter and then put nail polishes in there for my nieces. And then maybe like a nail kit in there because they're like teens so they're all into like they're doing their nails so I thought this would be cute and you could definitely put stuff in here another item that I picked up that was from that beauty 360 that was from CVS and now is at Dollar Tree is this beauty organizer it's a compact and durable Oh, it's compact and durable. Uh, keeps beauty products tidy and organized. So it's this container right here. And you can tell the acrylic is pretty thick on this package. And I did buy two of them because I thought my mom could use them um, to organize her makeup. And it's like this. And you take off the lid. And she could probably put like her makeup brushes in here. She doesn't have to use the lid. Um, she could just have it without and have her makeup brushes. Or you can have like all kinds of lipsticks in here and just put the lid. But I thought I would give her uh, at least one of these so that she can like put all her stuff in there. But these are good and um, good quality. So if you see these at Dollar Tree, definitely pick those up. You can even give those out for Valentine's Day and put like makeup brushes for somebody and then or like beauty products in a basket. Another thing I picked up were these Diamond Cosmetics nail files and I don't know if this is a Dollar Tree brand. To be honest, I don't think it is. So I wanted to give these a try, but these could definitely be Valentine's Day because it has all the little hearts on here. And you can put these like in a little package for somebody, like I said, with something like these. These are the fashion nails from Dollar Tree. These are the leopard ones, but they have like a purple, like it has purple in it. If you can see right there, it has like purple right here. But these are pretty for, like I said, um, to gift. You can put them in some type of container and put nail polish, these, and then you can put it in this. You know, you can put all kinds of little stuff together. Okay, then I did pick up these from Dollar Tree. They're the Happy Birthday banner and then the number one. So I got the number one because my dog Archie is turning one years old Friday and I wanted to do like a mini photo shoot with him and I also got this one but this one is in silver so I don't know if I'll use this one or one or the other. I don't know because one is gold and one is silver and I couldn't find a one in silver. Uh, along with um, Archie turning one, I found these in the party section and they're little crowns and I thought I could put like a little crown if he lets me because he, if you know my dog, um, he is a terror <clears throat> and he will not let you put anything on him. Like, he will uh, attack you. So, I thought maybe I could put, like, the little crown on him. Um, it is, like, you know, it's not that great quality. But, you know, I thought I could maybe try and <laughs> put it on his head. And I, I think it might be cute on him. But I did pick these up. These come with six mini crowns. It comes with different colors. Um, so, it has a gold one. So, if I want to do gold or the green... This is a silver and then the blue, but I think I might do the blue and maybe do the happy birthday in the back. I'm not sure. This is pretty neat for right now, everything that's going on. This is a, a no touch key and it says um, you're basically supposed to use it like your fingers. Let me just show you. I It's this little gadget you put on your you know your keychain or whatever but when you go and like punch in the numbers like at a store you use this part of it and then you can also use this to open up doors so if you see this you put 
it's the door handle right here and you're supposed to pull so that you're not touching stuff you're kind of just using this um, but I thought this would be neat to just have because with everything going on it does show you how to use them right here so but they had some see how you pull the handle and then you can use it on like keypads like at drive through or at the store so that you're actually not physically touching anything you're just using this but I picked up this one this one was like the prettiest one that I saw and I just really like the colors of it I don't know if it's focusing but just thought this would be cool it's like a thick acrylic so I don't know I wanted to try it out because it doesn't hurt to try and just to be a little bit more precautious of you know especially everything that's going on and right now our state is um on really like it's high on covid cases okay so i picked up some more things and these are i think my last things that i'm going to share with you guys because i think i'm 26 minutes in and yeah so these items i picked up are beauty items and i picked up these wet and wild these are velvet matte lip colors the one i picked up is to toffee frap and this is the color i don't know if you're gonna be able to see uh, hold on so this one is the toffee frap let me put all this stuff down i'm gonna swatch it it's actually a really pretty color i actually have this on my lip but i also have lip liner so it kind of changes the color when you have like a lip liner but I definitely picked up this one and I think it's like my favorite one and then I picked up a different color this one is berry tails and it's this one so this is the packaging color and then this is the color that I and I'm gonna swatch that it's actually like so it's this one right here I don't know I go for these colors so I think these are pretty my favorite one is that toffee frap then I picked up this wet and wild ultimate eyebrow highlighter these are neat because you can actually put these in your waterline instead of on your eyebrows uh, like right here instead of putting it right there you would put it underneath in your waterline and it just opens up your eyes instead of using like a starch white you would use this one because it's more like a nude color and not a bright white oh see it's more like a nude color i do have it in my waterline if you can hold on so i do have it in my waterline right now and it really just it's supposed to open up your eyes if you do that but you can also use it like um as a whatever it is highlighter ultimate brow highlighter i just think it's kind of chalky if you put it like right here you have to really blend it in really well in order for it not to like look like you actually just did like a little line but i mean honestly it's for a dollar and it's from wet and wild i think these used to go for more than that Another thing I picked up is this Wet n Wild Pump Keep Going Waterproof Sweatproof Eyeshadow. This I tried and this one is in the color Protein Shake. And I'm going to show you guys the color because I think it's really pretty even if you're using it as like a base and not um, an eyeshadow. It's still a, a pretty you know it's pretty just like that um you can definitely just blend it and use it like an eyeshadow i would say when you put this on you can use a brush but i would say just use your finger like when you're putting it on your um your lid just put it on and then kind of blend it in with your finger um but this is a pretty color and they had other colors but i don't i only picked up this one because i knew i would probably just use this one like I said, you could probably put these all together and put these as a Valentine's Day gift. But these are good and they're the only ones that I picked up. They did have other ones, but these are, like I said, the only ones I picked up. I didn't want to pick up anything I wouldn't use and I just wanted to give them a try. But I definitely recommend the lip products. 
Uh, actually, I recommend all four of them, to be honest. I recommend all these. So, yeah, I, I just wanted to make sure that I would like them before I would pick up some for, like, my sisters. But honestly, I don't even, I haven't seen them since. So, like I said, Dollar Tree, always pick it up. Last beauty item that I have is this um, Kiss Gel Nail Polish. Um, So, this one is a kind of, like, hunter green. And this green would have been perfect for Christmas, but I didn't see it until after Christmas. Uh, but does it have a name on it? I don't think it does. But I love these nail polishes. The Kiss Gel ones, they are really nice. The gel part, it leaves like a shine on it. So I like these. I recommend these from Dollar Tree. But that is it for this haul. I was going to share some of the Valentine's Day from uh, Dollar General. Actually, let me just go ahead and do that. Okay, so I have another thing from Walmart. These are 97 cents. If you pick these up, pick these up now because, um, you know, they go by fast. Dollar Tree also has these, but Walmart has them for like three cents cheaper. But whatever, wherever you can get these, I pick these up. Like I said, I decorate for my dad's grave. So I normally glue this part down. Like I glue... The little part down because it will fly off so but these are nice to pick up like at Dollar Tree or Walmart then the 99 cent only store I only picked up these two again it's for um, decorating you can decorate basically anywhere with these but they're these picks and they kind of are you know you could put these in flower arrangements but I picked these up they're super glittery I picked these up for my dad, so um, that's why I picked these up. Like So stuff like this, I usually just get, you know, for him. As well as these. These are from Dollar General, and these are the foam decorations. Walmart carries these, Do uh, Dollar Tree, Dollar General. Everywhere really carries these. But I like the fact that these are in a four-pack, and they you know, are bigger hearts. So they're super cute, but you can change out this bow colors, which I might do. Um, and then I did pick up some small stuff. The, this one I picked up, this one I've had for a couple years ago. Um, this one is not new, but I just want to share. But, so I picked up this one. So this is a new one. And then this is the old one that I've had, but they're pretty similar. And these are a dollar and this one's gold, but I might paint that in pink or something else. I don't know. Then I did find this there for a dollar and it says love never fails. These are good little three tiered uh, tray stuff. So again, a dollar there. It's a little easel. And I think it's cute. Then again, I found this one. This is a, like a, the metal. So it's metal, but this is not for myself. It's going to be something I use for my dad. And this one just says follow your heart. And it's that truck. But it is like metal. But you can put these inside wreaths. And they're really cute. Okay. And I picked up these boxes. Which I think they're... <laughs> like I cannot not pick these up. These This one was a dollar. But it has the XOXO on the top. The side is that red and white then I, this one was a dollar as well but it's smaller so as you can see it's a smaller box this one says happy valentine's day well it says happy and then heart uh day and then again this one was a dollar and then the last couple things that i picked up are these which are very sought out and i picked one for a friend one for myself one for my sister and I think one for each of my sisters. So one for me, one for my friend, one for my two sisters. So there's four of them. But these are the little hearts. I know that everybody's looking for these. But this one says you and me with the white and red hearts. The be mine. I found this one and it has the beads and... I found two of these, but if you can tell, one of them is darker than the other. But these are the beads. And then this one says true love. And then it has the uh, wood beads with the red. 
So I did find these. And like I said, these ones are very sought out. And these are all a dollar. So these are cute for a dollar. You can't really beat these. So. Last thing. It's from Amazon. I swear it's the last thing. I picked up this uh, pillow cover. And this one just has the truck with all these hearts and then it says love at the top i'll link it down below for you guys to be honest um i picked it out but i don't like the fabric um uh, material so um do i recommend if you like these like they have these for like all the holidays if you like the fabric then yes but it, my preference no i don't like the fabric but you know what i went ahead and kept it so uh, this one is from Amazon, and if you like it, maybe you like it, um, but this is the back. You can kind of see another pillow that I have there, but if you like it, I'll link it down be below for you guys. But sorry, this video is super long. If you're still here, give me a heart little emoji or whatever it is <laughs> and that is it i hope you guys enjoyed this video if you did give me a thumbs up and i'll talk to you guys in another one bye